Welcome to the Zenfinex MetaTrader 5 tutorial series. In this section, I will show you how to place orders on the MT5 platform. As a UK regulated broker, we kindly request you take the time to read the risk warnings contained in this slide. So let's begin and look at the several ways of placing orders on the Zenfinex MetaTrader 5. The simplest method is by going to the chart on the top left hand corner there's an icon by clicking on the icon a drop down will appear. You are able to select the trade size by either entering or up and down on this um, tab bar. And if we decided that we wanted to place an immediate market order and we believe the direction was up, we simply press the buy button and an, a buy order with 0.2 lot sizes will immediately be placed in your account. And you're able to see the running profit and loss on this particular order and you can either as part of your strategy determine to place stop loss orders or target orders on this particular running trade and you can do that by simply clicking on the stop loss or take profit box and a dialog box will come up whereby we are able to play, uh, place additional stop loss and take profit orders by entering a price. So let's determine that we believe that the target price for this particular running order will be 1.3415. This is for demonstration purposes only and it's not part of any strategy. It's just to show you how to adjust your take profit and stop loss orders. So let's just pick 34.33. 34, 33. And let's say that if we're wrong, we want to place a stop loss order underneath the entered price. So let's just pick a randomly 34, 4, 10. 30, sorry, 33. 30, let's just put 3300. Zero, zero. And by Pressing this button underneath, modify the order. What has happened is that the order is still running, but now we have placed a stop loss and a take profit order on this particular running order. And we can see the dotted lines showing you where the take profit level is and where the stop loss level is. And by highlighting the particular order, we're able to modify the order by simply clicking on the line and moving it up and down. And I'll just show you, you can move the target as well. And by moving the target, you'll see the price also changes. Now, if we had decided as part of our strategy, we want to exit this position, we simply press close and the order will immediately be closed. And we're able to go to the history tab to take a look at that particular order that we have just placed. And we banked a $2 profit on this particular order. So it's a very simple process of press, selecting your trade size, determining direction, placing the order, and modifying or inserting a stop loss and take profit order. The second method of placing orders is we're able to right click on the chart and by pressing the trading tab and new order box, we're able to determine where we would like to enter the market. And we can use either immediate execution or pending order. Let's pick pending order in this example. And let's say that we wanted 
or believed that if price reached a certain level, we could uh, enter an order. When price reaches that level, we would be entered into the market. So let's just pick a level for demonstration purposes. So let's just pick 34.70. So let's say that we believed that market was going to go up and when this level had been reached, we want to place a buy order. And to get somewhere near it, we can just put, and I'm just going to go back, 34.52 is going to be where 34.22. And as part of our strategy, obviously, we want to have um, stop loss and target orders in. And we're able to do that by determining that if this is a buy order, the stop loss would be lower than the price. So the stop loss has to be lower than your entered price. So let's say 33.41. And I'll just put that in. 33. I'm just picking some random numbers here just for demonstration purposes only. And let's say our target was 35.07. We go to 35.07. And by pressing the place um, button, an order pending order will be placed. So you can see the green line will be if price reaches this level, only then the order will be accepted into the marketplace. And when that order has been accepted, a stop loss and the take profit order will also be entered into the market. And if we determine that we want to move any of these levels, and by simply clicking on it, we can adjust our entry prices by moving our mouse up and down. And all the prices get adjusted automatically in these lower levels here. So if I want to remove that order at any time, I can simply press the X button and the order will be cancelled. The other method is that I can use my cursor and I can say, OK, I like this level here. If price reaches this level, I want to place a sell order. So I can simply go to trading and I can put a sell limit order, which basically means that if price reaches this level, a sell order, believing that the market will continue coming down and for profit. And we can adjust our stop loss orders and our take profit orders in the same way as we did before. And that concludes our short video on how to place orders. Thank you very much for watching this video. And of course, if you want to open a Zenfinex account, click on the link below and it can get uh, uh, you can get underway very, very quickly.